Hello and welcome to Age of Empires 3 Tips and Tricks with me, Interjection. Today's video will be about teleporting settlers through your town centre. Sometimes, instead of walking around your town centre to get to resources, it can be a lot faster to just go through it. This can be especially true at the very start of a game if your crates appear on one side of the TC, but your hunt's on the other side. When this happens, of course after you've split your villagers onto one crate each and have gotten your first villager in queue at around the 6 second mark as discussed in the previous video, you'll need to kill your first huntable animal. So, if it is on the other side of the town centre, to teleport your settlers through, select the ones you want then garrison them inside the town centre by right clicking on it. Next, select the town centre and change the rally point to the huntable animal. Then, ungarrison your villagers who will then start working at the rally point you set, just like a freshly created villager would. If you do all this fast enough, it looks like they're instantly teleporting through, but actually they're not. You're just very quickly garrisoning in one place and ungarrisoning in another by changing the rally point somewhere in between. To get good at doing this efficiently, I highly recommend remembering two different hotkeys. The letter T on your keyboard, which selects your town centre for you, and the letter N, which ungarrisons all units inside your town centre for you. So, to recap teleporting, select your settlers, garrison them, press the letter T to snap to your town centre, set a rally point, and then press N to eject the villagers out onto that point. Top level players will sometimes even use this trick when gathering up a resource shipment. Even if the crates aren't actually on the other side of the town centre, but the player is really in a hurry to gather them up, for example a 700 coin shipment containing the last few resources they need to click up to the fortress age with, it might be worth the player's time to teleport one or two settlers through the town centre to the other side of the crates to minimise villagers bumping around into each other as they all try and crowd around it trying to frantically gather it up. This way, they can get the gold more efficiently and age up a bit faster. And as we all know, in Age of Empires 3, age up times can really make a difference in the outcome of a game. Finally, if you do take the time to remember the N hotkey, it can also be used for other things such as ungarrisoning units from ships and boats, which might someday be useful. It's also worth noting that you can teleport villagers through towers and outposts as well, but the N hotkey doesn't work for these buildings since they have a different hotkey assigned to them for the same function. Instead of telling you that button as well, I would rather instead encourage you to head into your options menu and change whatever it is to N as well, so that there's only one thing to remember. Learning hotkeys is a really great way for new players to get good quickly. So if you do change the outpost on garrison button to N, maybe take a look through the other hotkeys as well, and maybe even set your own custom ones. I'm never going to do a dedicated video on hotkeys, because that would contain far too many arbitrary letters to remember in a single video to be useful to any new player. Instead, I'd like to slowly weave new hotkeys into each video to make them easier to digest over time. Thank you very much for watching, leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and the next one will be about how terrible the town centre bell function is. You can click the link to watch that now. See you next time!